Dear friend, welcome to my channel, Germany Architecture. Today's topic is Dialex 10.2. So, what is uh, new in Dialex 10.2? So, I will explain that. But first of all, we do street lighting on Dialex 10.2. So, this is my screen. And uh, you see this road. This is 3D view. Okay. Here is some options. Uh, this is a Roadway one, suppose you want to increase a uh, road, add roads. So click on this option. So that will be increased. If you want to delete that thing, select this one and remove. It is sidewalks. One more sidewalk, click this one. Now you see the two sidewalk coming. That side, so I want to place this sidewalk to this area. So what you do just drag and drop it here. Now you see one sidewalk coming on right and one sidewalk coming on left. Okay, now uh, I'll place some luminary on this road. So I go to light and select So I have this one, click this one. Now click this one, add road illuminate arrangement. This is our YouTube channel, Germany Architectural. If you want to learn dialects free of cost, so go here, Germany Architectural. Then after you click on playlist. Here you see there is the Dialex videos, Dialex Evo tutorials. Uh, there are 43 videos in Dialex. If you want to learn, click on Dialex Evo tutorial. That is free of course. There are other software also. Suppose you want to learn AutoCAD. This is AutoCAD also. There is Stat Pro, Revit, Rhinosaurus, Tacla software, Kidias Max, Katia. This all software are free of cost. And this is our website. Germany Architectural and if you want to learn Dialex Evo that is chargeable go here and click here Dialex and this is a course content of Dialex Evo hope you like this information if you like this information please subscribe our channel and press the bell icon for latest information thank you see this light are placed on the road and here is some option also this is arrangement only on upper side the placement change both side okay and two side arrange offset See. now this is a pole distance check off this one you just manually do the place do the uh, Pole distance okay, and now right now that is a 15. So I just uh, give 10 meter the pole distance 10 meter and pole center height. Okay, this pole height is 8 meter. You want to reduce that one, go here and I just reduce in 6 meter. Okay, now you see pole height decreased. This is the boom angle. Boom angle is suppose you want to rotate that light angle. I just give 20 degree on that one. Now see. Okay, uh, this is number of illuminate on the pole. Suppose you want to two illuminate on the pole. Now this is two illuminate on the pole. Okay, one more thing I do. Okay, suppose I do, do place uh, this imagery on the center. So what I do, I go here, click this one, add median. Okay, remove this one also, side fork. And drag and drop in between of these two roads. Now this is my median. Okay, go to light option 
and now you see one more option is coming here click this one now you see the lights poles are placed on the center okay this is a light overhang now you see the pole boom angles boom length is increased okay now we go to manual calculations click on the click on here and calculate now go to documentations uh, first of all you just go on projects here you place the name Project and address. Telephone number. Then after go to documentations. Okay, I have uh, all that content which I want to include in my docu documentation so here is this uh, this is a uh, correct data sheet descriptions images so if you want an image place that here so what you do you go plan go on planning and here the view and I just take this view and save new. Sorry, uh, save new. Then go to documentation and I want to change this size. I have so I select this one. Now click hit on this one. This is my image. Okay, apply. Now you see the image apply on your dominations. Go to configure, and I don't require the this option limitary dry limitary and this one semi sub I don't need okay go to edit and Remove this one glossy and add it off. Then go to uh, project. Okay. Okay, no, go here and then after export page to selected. Second of the import page to selected. We don't require this. I, I just click on show entire documentations. Now save as, save as PDF. If you want to increase that resolution, so click on 300 FII. Okay. Save. Okay, this is my uh, documentation.
If you like this video, please subscribe our, cha subscribe our channel, press the bell icon for latest information about new video. Thanks for watching my video. Hope you like that video.